So let's talk about specialised animal cell. Let's talk about ciliated epithelial cells. So ciliated epithelial cells tend to look like a normal cell except for one key difference. They have these long hair-like structures on them called cilia. They still have things like nucleus and mitochondria and all our normal components of our animal cell, but we've got these cilia. And these cilia are hair-like structures that move backwards and forwards. Or as I like to say, they waft. So that's meaning they're going to go from side to side in sort of a Mexican wave sort of motion. Now this is really important for their function. They're found in two locations. They're found in the cutia, or the windpipe, and they move things like mucus and dust away from our lungs, so for a protective function. The other place you might find them is in the oviduct, which joins our ovaries to our uterus, and they move the egg away from the ovaries towards the uterus in an attempt for fertilization leading to pregnancy or menstruation. And that's everything you need to know about ciliated epithelial cells.